limitless opportunities. That's what you get when you live in Boston. You could be, do, or have anything you want. It's that easy. Except when you're an actor, of course. Now, I'm not saying there's no opportunity for actors in Boston, but come on. All the big movies that get filmed in Boston are usually casted in, drum roll. Yep, you guessed it, LA. So the most we get on a regular basis are what we call extra work. Basically, you're a blur in the background. Not my favorite job at all. You see that black guy on the right side of your screen? Right, right, right there, right there, yep. That's me, AKA Chase. Now I'm grateful for what I've been able to get my hands on and they've been great experiences, but it's not enough to really put me on the map. Until now. Hello? Hi, is this Chase? This is he. Hi Chase, this is Jennifer Darrow with Boston Casting. I'm calling to see if you're available to do extra work this Friday in Andover, Massachusetts for a local commercial. <clears throat> Hello, hey, sorry about that. Do you say this Friday? I believe I'm available. Okay, great. You will receive an email confirmation with details to wardrobe, call time, and destination. Alright, well, uh, thank you. You're welcome, and we'll see you Friday. Alright, have a good one. Bye. Okay, well, I, I didn't mean this very second, but trust me, I have a flawless plan. It's an idea I picked up from a colleague doing extra work. But before I get into that, let me quickly introduce to you my brother Cyrus, AKA Cy, his wife Ivana, AKA Ava, and their cat Loden and their dog Mila. Oh, oh yeah, and they're expecting a baby girl who will go by the name Amaya. I will welcome you to her room. But for the time being, this is where I get my sleep on. Greetings. I brought Amy here to show her some of the work I'm doing. I got it. 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 Hey, do hey, I detect hey. a hint of condescension? I'm sorry. Oh, come on, man. What, is it? what are you doing? Are you serious? What is it, Chase? Thank you for asking. Now, aren't you tired of being called to be a blur in the background of a movie? and get shit pay. So what if I told you, I can help you get bigger parts. I can help you make more money. Are you ready? Webisode. We write a script. We'll send it off to SAG. They're gonna see it, they're gonna read it, they're gonna like it because we're creative people. Anyways, they're gonna sign it. They'll send back contracts if they like what they see. Equity at the door. Are you sure it's that easy? I think. Maybe. But. I say we just give it a try. Actually, it's not a bad idea. I'm in. Thank you. Okay. We have one. Uh, I don't know about this. You know what? Forget it. I'll pay you both a hundred bucks each. Well, okay. I'm in. Thank you. Now what? We create. So what's the webisode going to be about? Okay. Great question. So, I figured, we're all fit, we're all dancers, we're all actors and all that stuff, we're pretty beefed up. I'm thinking something along the lines Porno? of... Porno? What? No. No. I'm thinking action-packed. Okay. Better than porno. What about equipment? What are you talking about? Uh, how about we start with a camera? And lights. A boom mic. A computer that actually works. And it's reliable. Let's say we go with your idea. How much is this going to cost? Well, if you're thinking of a mid-budget professional film, mm. it's going to be like 5 to 10K. 5 to 10K? There goes that plan. Okay, I got it. I got it. Let's start with the computer. You have no money. Hey, don't worry about it. I got it covered. Okay, trust me. Look, bro, we both don't know what you're thinking, but knowing you is not gonna be safe or smart. <laughs> so let's just take a pause and reconvene and just we'll think about another you're plan, okay? You're precious time sitting and arguing here when we can be brainstorming. So let's all relax. I'll be back. Script, got it.
Well, should we call your mom now, or should we wait till he gets arrested? <laughs> arrested. <laughs> <laughs> next door neighbor please tell me you didn't rob one of our neighbors yo if you decided to rob sweet betty sue next door man that's your ass dog no 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 i asked to borrow it and she practically let me have it bs bro this is a two thousand dollar computer she would not just let you have this it's not like we don't believe you wait, wait it's not like she doesn't believe you. I don't believe you, bro. Okay, either way, I just need to know play-by-play play how this went down because I don't want people knocking down our door. We don't want cops knocking yeah, down cops our door. Yeah, knocking down our door. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. But I will explain to you. See, it all started when I knocked on her door. Good afternoon, neighbor. It's a beautiful day, wouldn't you agree? Yes, it is. How can I be of assistance today? Well, I hate asking for favors, and this is not like me. Oh, no, it's fine. No favor is too big or too small. How can I help you? Well, I'm a local director, and I'm actually working on an exquisite project. But my computer has crashed. Yeah, and I was wondering, after capturing my great footage, is there any way I can come over and probably utilize your computer with hopes of, you know, editing my work? That's if it's okay with you, of course. Ah, oh, neighbor, I could do you a better one. I have this computer. I was going to donate it to the Boys and Girls Club. I can give it to you. Oh, no. I can't take the computer. What about the kids? Please take the computer. It would be my honor to help you. Oh, my. There is a God, and you're his angel. Thank you so much, and God bless. And that's how I came to have the computer you see before you.
Wap. You know what? Maybe have a little drink. That happened. Maybe have a little nap. I'm gonna go to my room. We were not accusing people for dumb shit. All right. Maybe brainstorm a bit. I don't care what y'all think. When I done told y'all the truth. And, and, you know, we're gonna be a little less antsy. All right. So I'll see you two tomorrow. All right. Love y'all. Well, what space do we have for the computer? Um, space. Problem solver. Space. Alright. Alright, well. You two have a good night. Love you both. Holla back. See you the AM. All right, all right, all right. I know exactly what you're thinking. You just see me do all that shit, and you're like, damn, this guy is completely awesome. And you know what? It takes an awesome person to know an awesome person, so that makes you awesome as well. Congratulations. See, there's a quote that says, there comes a point in time where you get sick and tired of being sick and tired, when you're tired of being sick, when you're tired of sick and then, okay, well, you get the point. All I'm saying is I had nothing to show for myself until today when I grabbed life by the balls. So, I invite you to ride along, all right? Hop in the passenger seat, but put on your seatbelt. It's gonna be a bumpy ride. And yes, I do keep cereal and milk by my bed every night. Don't judge me. Aha! Uh -huh. Okay! Right, right, right. Mm -hmm. I ain't with the bag before, I ain't back before I like you Fuck up what you asking for, but you're back before I like you But is your man still back at home, he ain't that important like that You ain't really seen it like that before, not like that before you like When you put it like that, like that, like that, like that You like bitch, you like, I bitch, I bitch, you like, I bitch, you like